as one seat has a power connectors and have two things on the front. That doesn't go very far. Oh, it requires, oh, it requires, ah, yes. So that requires power. But can I hook it up like this just to get it out the way? It has battery storage. That's good. So you can move this way now. We just need to get some trailers on you. And some things on the front, it seems. Trailer, aluminium compound. Aluminium. Do we have any compound? Oh, I'll write that. Let's see here. Trailer. Since there's a power plug, it might also be a good way to uh, activate these. Yes, because there's active power plugs. That's good. So, you can go to there. Then we can hook up a medium platform and drag quite a few items on it. Let's, let's try and get that for power supply and such. Or maybe just get one more tractor. Or trailer, sorry. Let's see here. Trailer. Then again, if we put on a generator on it, we can just pick up organic matter to charge it again. That might actually not be a bad idea. Let's try this. There you go. Um, small generator. Or just add a wind turbine to it. It also have two things in the front. What if we add some kind of drill? I think I saw a drill mod somewhere. And a paver. Silicon aluminium alloy. We can make that. It's quite expensive. Drill strength. Drill strength is two. That's just better drills. Ceramic and carbon. That's also on the first world. So for now, let's just try and go explore and see if we can find some things to bring back. That's the spring. Don't have spring, one battery. That is going to be enough to charge it. Let's try. Let's see how good this tractor is. Oh. Okay, it's a bit derpy. It's very derpy. <laughs> um, go this way. It's stuck on most things, it seems. That is some research material I want to bring back. Can I then put that on it? Stay there. That's the thing that's shooting. Okay, so just have these two just to test it out. Bring those back. Might be easy just walking out here myself. Oh, there it is. Do you think? Let's bring you back right there. Maybe clear out some of these trees. Maybe just make a path for it to go. Would also be a good way to do it going forward. Oh, unless you just figure out how to use it. Hey, hey Q. Welcome to the stream again. Watching me derp around on our little... Tractor. 
Okay, so as long as I can get this one through, the trailers behind it will easily sort itself out. That is good to know. And power-wise, it is using a bit. But uh, that's fine. I'm guessing when we get a paver or a drill mod in front, that might help a bit in terms of how it works. Automatic trans small items into open slots. Uh, one of this can drive around and just pick up a ton of research things. But they can't pick up these. But maybe something else? <laughs> well, this looks a bit derpy. This is my new hat, so I don't get sun in my eyes. <laughs> oh well, let's move you over here. I want you to be on this one to make my power supply much better. I'm still moving with these on. No, that makes it unmovable. That's uh, something we'll have to think about. But it should be fine. So let's make some more power. Because that is kind of what we're needing. And small medium storage. So let's try this. I guess as soon as we can get larger battery packs, that will also help. Like Lego bricks. Huh. Yeah. You actually are correct. That's a bit. Let's get you back here. Then I can move just two of these. I need 16, I think, to power one of these. Could also just make a few of these to drag it all the way up there. Since I am in the situation where I don't have to call it. Or can I move anything on it? That's another reason why we should put it on one of these. Just to connect it up. Get the other medium storage. And there we are. What if we make trailer... Oh, we can make a trailer four long. That should give the same or five long. Then we can use that to, to do it. That might actually be a much easier way to do it. Uh, okay, let's try this. Uh, let's get you all in here for now. Arch you as well, please. Arch you. Wouldn't that work the way I am envisioning it? So that can hold four... Eight so four rows will be sixteen, but it's also just a long extension if we wanted to go between two things. So how can I get back? Do it, you think? What if just do this and use you as an extension cord? <laughs> Not sure this was how it was intended, but I think it could, it could work. Or maybe just without the tractor it will work. Can we then disconnect you? And connect these up instead? Close. Close, close, close. Okay, let's try new things. And you can connect up here if you're not so derpy. Hopefully this will work. 
Okay, that won't connect up. Oh, there we go. So now if we connect these up, we will be able to get the power, I think. Just need to connect them up with these. Oh, just wish we had, wish we had extenders instead. That'll make this a lot easier. Power is a bit derpy. Um, let's get more resin, please. And then let's move all of this over. So we have eight. You're not charged. No, you're being used. That just means more wind turbines to get this running. Is what we need. Let's get all of you moved down to our big power supply right here. And we could, in theory, set up a few generators just to generate a bit more organic ones. That feels a bit like cheating. So let's wait a second with that. But it's funny how much power you need for different things. That is kind of what's holding us back a bit. Oh yeah, you're correct. Not correct. You're right. Oh, thank you for that. That is actually a very good point. That is that actually. Oh, hmm. That is a very very good point. It kind of makes you want to move this. Thank you for that information, by the way. That's something. That's sixteen. That's twenty. Let's get a bit more made. I want to make an entire platform, then we should be able to do it. Why wouldn't you always just use solar panels and wind turbines as extenders? I know they're a bit more expensive, but then they generate power for you. There's pretty much no downside from what I can see. Except you have to craft maybe six, ten times as many. I can't remember how many is in one extender. Let's take you go there. Here and look at this nice battery right here. That is a battery that will that can power something. Let's take a few of you and make more or wait. Just gonna go get some quartz. We should have some just inside the tunnel. Then, oh, then we'll make a ton of things. Let's see here, quartz should be right at the ceiling. There we are. It means we'll make some glass, we'll make some soap, uh, wind turbine extenders. This will cost a small amount of power, but that's fine, because you will generate more power. Okay, let's go. Let's make a wind turbine network to power this one. And to give us more power in the future.
There we go. That's a ton of glass. That should give us just a few wind turbines. Let's see how much is it, it give us gives us in in like range. Let's see if we put you here. Or can I pull you? Quite, quite far, to be honest. Do that. Let's get a few more. And then we should be able to power this. Let's just get three more. Because I want to leave them afterwards just as... Uh, as cabling. One solar panel, sorry, not solar, one wind. There we are. And let's go up here. And maybe one more will be enough to connect it up. Go here. Uh, let's get this tractor thing away, please. It was a good idea, but. Let's see if this doesn't work now. We should have enough power stored up at least. Let's see. That drains quite quickly. But hopefully it's enough to activate it. Oh, that goes down very quickly. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Just the middle one. Oh yeah, more than enough power. Come on. Brilliant. So that's one more thing activated. Can we travel to other planets from here? Is what I want to know. Yes, we can. We can travel to... Wait, we can't. We have to go to the middle to travel to other planets. So I think it's about time we dig to the middle and see what it requires down there. This at least activated this part. You can just kind of stay. And digging to the middle is somewhat easy to do. Shouldn't take us that long. I might want to change the orientation a small amount when going down. Um, oh, we might need a better drill, to be honest, when we get uh, further down. Because right now we have a drill mod 1. I guess this one does better as we go further down. Let's see here. Uh, please take this. That will need some tethers as well. To continue. We actually need a lot of tethers. And did we have some... I think we have some further down. And you can start to research again. About a thousand more on that one. This will go generate enough power for us so we can easily leave this up here. So let's get a bit more compound. We should have some right here. Oh, we have dug out pretty much all of it, it seems. Oh, 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 oh. let's not do something like that. All to our death. We'll probably find more when we go down. Hopefully. So... Is that the bundle? And let's go towards the center of this planet. I want to extend this one. Because it makes a bend right here. I don't really want it to do that. It's a small bend, so it might be fine. We'll just kind of fix it a small amount, so we can actually not go too badly out the side. This be fine. Stop! 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 Please close this off. 
And then we should be able to slide here, continue down this way. And continue this way down. Oh, do not want to do that. Stop here. Let's just make sure we have a nice slope. Because if you have a nice slope going down, it should be a lot easier to get back and up. Stuff like that. So. There we are. Good, let's slide. And let's continue down this way. Watch the center of the earth. What do we have here? That seems like a little cave. A big cave. That looks ominous. Well, that's fine. There's a lot more lithium down here. That's good. Oh, let's remember to get the tether down. There we are. We're still going downwards. You have to remember to recheck your angle once in a while. When doing this. Otherwise you can't end up going up again at some point if you just continue. Because at some point you'll get through the other side of the world. Stop that. Thank you. Yeah. And there. Might have to change my change my angle a bit again. Right now we we are still going down. Pretty well. Oh, that's fine. And if you know of a better way of going down than this, I think this is pretty efficient. As long as you remember, oh, let's get you away. Go, let's continue. I wish there was some kind of way to can see your orientation. For example, if you went down 60 degrees or 90 degrees or something like that, you always know uh, if you're going down. That would be quite nice to have. So we should probably... Oh, that looks weird, this wall. Fine. Let's try and go a bit steeper here again. Let's see how steep. Uh, something like that, maybe. Yeah, this is going a bit then. Here we are going steeper again. Good. So let's continue down.
Oh, oh, a bit too. <laughs> that feeling when you all of a sudden start to slide when you don't want to. Let's see what we can find down here. Yeah, let's go see a bit. There we are. There we go. What do we have here? Okay, we are going down at a pretty nice rate. No, 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 no. Shit, this bad. I need to get up. Uh, come on. Oh. I'm so glad I learned that trick a while back. <laughs> that you can uh, hold alt under yourself and then just stick like this back and forth. Then you go straight up. I have died in a cave before because I fell over the edge like that. That was a real lifesaver. That was quite bad. But it could have been quite bad. Right now. Oh, yes. Compound. Perfect. I don't need to go up top to get the tethers. drop a few of you. We don't really need you down here. We need to tether some more. Go, let's get you and you. Yeah, that's good. There we are. I'm just glad that you can keep doing this. You don't have to go up with the soil every time. If I had to do that, this will be a much longer process. So how many of you guys have completed the uh, Astroneer? Don't know if uh, if any of you have, or if you're even playing Astroneer. Let's see. Let's go down a bit more. Ah, yes, new cave. With is that a new kind of plant I haven't seen before? Okay, that is new plants I haven't seen before. They look like something that wants to eat me. The berries. Hey, weird world. That one I know is dangerous. I should use poison clouds. These on the other hand, I hope they're not da uh, dangerous. Let's just continue down and see what we can find. Well, they are at the ceiling, so hopefully they're not dangerous.
There's a weird biome. 